When we moved into our house in Mexico in January of 2020, the street dog, pictured here on the left, was pregnant. We didn't know her and she didn't come near us, but we could tell she was pregnant. We conveniently named her Mama. She's really sweet. Well, she gives birth to this puppy here on the right, pictured here with our dog. We never saw the other puppies in her litter. We named this puppy, Puppy. We obviously are very creative with names. A few months later, that's when the fiasco begins. So she gets pregnant, being that she's a street dog who is not fixed. She had given birth in an abandoned shack with a fence nearby and this poor little guy had gotten stuck. So we quickly realized it's just so dangerous for street dogs and their puppies. God, I'm nice and so. Yeah. We began to take care of all of her precious little puppies who she had given birth to in an abandoned shack across the road. They were so precious. Lydia then to visit. This one is still She's hiding. a girl, yeah. We already got a picture of you. This one's a boy. We already got a picture of him mm -hmm. too. Just look, I'm surrounded by puppies and I love it. I love it. Okay, we got five puppies ready for their worming treatment. I know, I just gave them a bath, they're covered in fleas. They look so much better today. All their fleas are gone, it's just a few here and there. They look so shiny and healthy. And they eventually all got adopted. They all went to happy homes as far as we are aware. We were so grateful we had rested from our work. However, we went on vacation to the US and came back and both dogs were pregnant, both puppy and mama. And puppy gave birth first, but mama was acting really weird and mama, jealous, probably confused because she was to the point of giving okay. birth as well. So they both gave birth within a week of each other and mama began to get very territorial and was trying to take over puppies, puppies. Sorry for the confusion. So we moved puppies, puppies, inside of our patio, inside of our porch to take care of them until they were weaned and to try to keep the litter separate. When they all get weaned, we move them all together to the same abandoned shed where mama had had her other litter and we began to adopt them off. They were quickly finding happy, healthy homes with our friends, neighbors, and acquaintances. I mean, just look at that. When all the puppies were adopted and mama and puppy had stopped nursing, we took them to the vet to get fixed. And I think they were pretty happy about it. Nowadays, mom and puppies just spend their time not having any more puppies and not being in heat. We're grateful for that. <laughs>